Assalamualaikum and good morning uh, Student There are four rules that you have to follow To answer pemahaman paper The first one The first one you have to check Is it Singular Or plural then you can eliminate the answer <laughs> okay and the third one check either it is past or present number four for the you have to Use EST plus EST and for then plus ER. And the last one is for if you saw two, and then the answer will go to the root word. Kembali kepada asal. So, number one. Azan wears a helmet and blank a bag. So, this one, Azan is singular. Okay. So, you can eliminate all the answer that have plural. For example, carry is for plural. So, eliminate carry. And then, when you see this ing carrying, it has to have a friends. For example, is, are, was, or were. And then, you eliminate this one. Okay, now we check. Is it past or present? Azan wears. As. That means this one is present. Carried is past tense. So, you eliminate carried. So, the answer is carries. Look at number two. You guess. You guess is singular. Bought bre uh, blank bread to make sandwiches. So oh, this one we don't have to use the rules. Okay. A loaf of bread, a piece of bread, a slice of, a packet of. A packet is something that is inside a plastic bag. A slice, sepotong. So eliminate, eliminate, and then a piece, se. Cerbis, so eliminate this one. So kita tinggal a loaf of. This is sebungkus. Eh sebungkus. Sebuku, sebuku roti. The third one, blank is your school located. Located ialah um, tempat. Okay, what is apa? Where, di, mana? Why, kenapa? When, bila? So, eliminate, eliminate, eliminate. The answer is where. Okay, next one. I saw a helicopter. This is helicopter. Flying a building. And this one is a building. Against ialah bersandar. Along ialah sepanjang. Under ialah di bawah. So, the answer is over. Di atas. I bought mother a blank of pearls for her birthday. Okay. Punch 
Sekukus Limnik Swarm is for bees Collection Beberapa barang String ialah se Rantai Okay, so Serantai poles. The answer is A. Number six. The queen had two son. Blank wanted them to be good prince. Two son. Plural. Okay. Two sons. Plural. Dua orang. He singular. She singular. We Plural and they, plural. So we are going to choose um, Pemaisuri ada dua anak. Oh, okay. I did something wrong here. The queen, Pemaisuri ada dua anak. Jadi, okay. Sorry, okay. The queen ada dua anak lelaki. Titik. Dia mahu mereka menjadi um, putera yang baik. So, kita fokus pada the queen. The queen ialah singular perempuan. He lelaki. They mereka. We kita. She ialah untuk perempuan seorang. Singular. So, we choose she. Okay, next question is uh, My family and I had a blank exploring Sarawak. Proverb. Okay. As blind as a bat, ini untuk orang yang tidak nampak. So, wait a minute. Action speak louder than word. Tindakan adalah lebih baik daripada bercakap. So, not this one. Whole nine yard ialah um, kawasan yang luas. So, tidak sesuai. Well of time ialah sero. No. So, we are going to choose C. Oops. Next page. Okay, look at the paragraph. Farhan is singular. I will put S as singular. Okay, Farhan is singular. And then make sure either it is present or past then. The family day celebrations at his school Last week, that will be past tense. Okay, a tense for number seven is present. Okay, we are going to eliminate that. And then for attending, is plus ing. It has to have friends. Is or was or were and we look at here there is no friend before the blank so we eliminate this one okay attend and attended attend is for plural present tense so we eliminate this one the answer is past tense attended okay for number eight there were a lot of games held. He, singular, participating in sack race and three leg race. So we can assume that he is singular. So we eliminate R because R is plural. Were is plural. Is and was. Is present tense. So, eliminate is. 
was a singular past tense. So the answer is C. Question number nine. He blank prizes for both games. Again, he is singular. So we are going to eliminate winning because they before the blank doesn't have is or was or were. So we eliminate winning. Win and wins, we cannot use it because this is present tense. So the answer is C for past tense. Next, choose the most suitable idiom. Okay. You will blank if you do not finish your chores by afternoon. Okay, awak akan sekiranya tidak menyelesaikan tugasan menjelang tengah hari. Get, get cold feet if for someone who is nervous. So, we we'll eliminate this one. Play it by ear. Menjalankan tugas. Okay. Hold your horses. Ialah bertenang. So, be in hot water. The answer is this one. Okay. The correct spelling. The correct spelling is miss. Okay. Spell. Okay, so we are going to eliminate this one and this one. Okay, this one is correct. This one is correct. However, you have to put is. So, the answer is D. Okay, next question. Encik Rahman is an ice cream seller. He sells. This one. Sells is a present tense. Okay. Many type of. Okay. This one. The text already said ice cream. So, the answer is ice cream. Every day, he honks his horn as he rides his. Okay. Uh, look at a motorcycle and count the tires. One, two, and behind another one is three. So, this is three. The answer is tricycle. When the children hear him, they came out of. Okay, this is T. So the answer will be their house. They stop him and buy ice cream. Off is switching off the lamp. Not this one. Four is. Kepada and from is daripada. So buy ice cream. Oops, buy ice cream from him. Okay, number 16 and 17 is kebat questions. How do you think of? How do you think all these people will travel to the Sina Harapan orphanage? Okay. Transportation. If you read this one, it said 40 students. Van, usually 12 uh, people. Train, not possible. Bus, more than 40 people. Car, Probably five people. 
So the answer we have to refer this one. 40 students. So the answer is bus. 17. Which of the following statement is true? Nine year old students can join this trip. Nine year old is year three. If you read this one, all level two mean year four, five, and six. So this one is incorrect. Eliminate. More than 50 students can join this trip. You can read here, it said 40 students only. So eliminate this answer. Adi can still give his name to Puan Melati on 3rd of June. Okay, let's see here. Date is 23rd June. And by 30th of May. So the answer, we can choose C. But make sure the answer for D. Those who wish to join this trip must pay 20 ringgit. Well, actually this one is true. Adi can still kiss him, give his name to Puan Melati on 3rd June. Oh, I'm sorry. This one is incorrect. C. 3rd June. And this one by the 30th of May. See, this one is incorrect. So, this one correct. Must be 20 ringgit here. Joe's uh, read the paragraph first. Joe's father carried him because Joe carried. Let's find carried. Okay. Carried him. Carried him out of the water. Why? He was carrying in pain and did not want to move he is in pain and cannot move cannot move could not walk okay accepted was afraid of the water no he is not afraid of the water just wanted his father his father to carry him not correct did not want to get off the water so, the answer is A. How did Joe feel at the end? Oh no, well, Joe, what a way to end an outing. He's pretty upset because he cannot stay at the beach. So, can we say sad? Yes. Can we say angry? No. Happy? No. Worried result? No. So the answer is A. From the passage, we can conclude that Joe's mother cooked lunch at the beach. No. Her mother, his mother already prepared it at home. Joe stepped on something sharp in the bushes. No, he is in the sea. Joe and his family left the beach in the evening. There's no time stated in the passage. So, Joe and his family reached the beach at 9 in the morning. Okay. They left their home at 8 o'clock and arrived at the beach one hour later. So, that be nine o'clock in the morning okay happy holiday guys